Alright, here's my iPad. I'm about to update this to iOS 7. Um, I'm currently on version... If I get this thing to focus... 6.1.3 on the iPad. Um, and I just got done downloading... Uh, the iOS 7 for iPad um, update. I just place it on my desktop so I can find it pretty easy. So what you would need to do next is go into iTunes. I already backed it up. I backed it up today at 4.14, which was... Ooh, can't get this thing to focus. It was about a half hour ago. And then with a Windows computer, you would have to shift click on update sorry I don't have a tripod for this camera so shift click so shift clicking will bring up the options to update to your um, particular iOS now from the stuff I've seen online um, you actually don't need to like restore your iPad as you would do on your iPhone to the original settings you don't need to factory reset it so I'm just gonna click here and press open and it says iTunes will update your iPad to iOS 7 and verify update with Apple so update and right now it's running through its check extracting the software And this should hopefully change in a second. And here we go. Now we have this. Some of the stuff you should see. And you have this giant Apple logo on the screen. It's going to run through its updates. And this is going to take a while, so I'll be right back when this is done updating. So it looks like we're almost there. Waiting for it to reboot. Running through one final check, I think. It's got this white screen. This is what you should see when you first start up your iPad. And this will just be like your configuration screen. So we just swipe, update complete, continue, enable, password for the cloud. And here's some of what your keyboard would look like. Oops, and one sec, let me put in my password. Let's put in my password, then next. And here is some other information iMessage, FaceTime, next, I'm not putting a password, do not add password, and welcome to iPad, okay, and that should pretty much do it, you will have all the 
goodies have you seen in the um, the iOS 7 keynote? Um, here is the uh, quick launch for your quick launch, quick settings and your your drop down shade for your notification actually covers the whole screen now. It has that same bounce with. Uh, Let's see if we can get that parallax effect with this. I'm not sure if you're going to pick it up in the camera, but it is there. A little bit. And here are your settings. What they would look like on the iPad. Pretty much the same, except everything's flat. A lot of use of uh, Helvetica font, it looks like here. Um, See if there's anything else. Um, all your icons look pretty flat. But otherwise, pretty cool. I will be bringing you more videos uh, as soon as I get uh, updates on this. Uh, if you have any questions, leave them in the comment section down below. Uh, please remember to comment and subscribe and also give this video a thumbs up. Thanks for watching guys.